star and my wish came true I bumped into you Travel very far But my heart's so close I'm so into you When I close my eyes I see your face Can't stop thinking of you Can't stop thinking of you Say good night, my dreams come true. Can't stop thinking of you. Can't stop thinking of you.
Yes. 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 Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to you. This you. Yes. You. Welcome to me. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hello, goldfish. Hello. Hello, everyone. Hello, lurkers. Whew. How are we doing? How are we doing? And also, how do you think I'm doing? How do I seem to be doing to you? Easy the question. Hello, hello. Are we live? So, hi. Ugh. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, hold on. What is this? Okay. We're good. We're good. Hi. Hello. Hello, Mst. Hello, Est, to you. On this holiday. Hello. Hope you're all doing well. Yes, I hope we're all doing well. Do I still have Tasky to interrupt? No. A little Tasky. It's okay. <sighs> hi, 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 hi. Hello! How was everybody's weekend? It's Monday. It's Monday. I've been up since 7. Which is not as bad. It's been up since 4. But I have to do that again tomorrow. So today, as long as we, we, uh... Today, as long as we get through fifth grade without too many problems, it be a good day. Tomorrow, I don't know yet. <laughs> I don't know yet. This is pure espresso. Probably. Who knows? Hi, hi. Hi, Aubrey. Hi, Goldfish. Happy to be here as always. Mm. Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> I'm happy. I'm happy that you enjoy being here. I'm happy that that people are, are seeming to be enjoyed by what? No, that's not. Scratch that. I'm happy that that I can still be a be be nice to people and, and give people a, a good time. Um. <laughs> so I was in the particular place at work today. <laughs> I was in the particular location at work today that was right next to the manager's office. It always feels good to do good. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Even the mean things that were said to me were said in a nice way today. It's funny. Should I tell, should I tell that or should I tell the other story first? Mean things or manager gossip? Which one do you want to hear? How tired do I look? I'm not hydrating enough at work. I get home and I'm like super overheated, but it's not hot. So I think that means I'm not hydrating enough. So are the mean things than gossip? Okay. What were they? One. One. I saw I'm learning. I'm training. I'm learning how things go. You know, so I have a partner <clears throat> that's doing the things with me and for me. And I'm standing next to them. So this customer comes up and is like, hey, how are you doing? And he's like, good. And then I'm like, good. How are you doing? He's like, good. Then he just looks at me. He goes, you're new, aren't you? I'm like, yeah. Yeah, how could you tell? You know what he says? He says, the blank stare. That's what gave you away. I'm like, I don't know what he's talking about. What blank stare? I'm working. I don't know. Everybody else is like, I, I like coming here because everyone's always so nice. But that guy is like, 
I can tell you're new. You have that aura about you. The other thing was, um, this guy made a whole, whole big show of going, uh, going, uh, like, uh, Hey, I know you're not going to hear this again today, but you know what? Keep the change. Oh, thank you, sir. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, then he looked right at the guy draining me. He's like, it's all for you. Not for him. No tip for me. No tip for the waffle. My blank stare, I guess. But it's all good. Like, objectively, those are mean things, but like... I feel absolutely fine about it. It'd actually be devastating. <laughs> I missed out on 30 cents. It's okay, Aubrey. <laughs> it was 30 cents. <laughs> that is not split two ways. <laughs> yeah, no. Like, the rest of it makes that, that's such a minor blip. It's, it feels good. <laughs> the rest of the job feels good. But it was really funny. Uh, being stationed where I was today, right next to the manager's office, I heard at least three, uh, requests for hire. I heard at least three different people walk up and be like, hey, are you guys hiring? Hey, I applied. Any response yet? Hey, I applied an hour ago. Any response yet? Or, hey, I haven't heard from you in two weeks. And that one was rough, because like, hey, we decided not to hire you. Bye. So all that was happening right behind me, I'm like... Did I? Is that what I was like? No. No. I, I thanked the manager again after I saw her like dismiss some people. I'm like, hey! Thanks for saying yes to me. Thank you. And she's like, no problem. So it was fun. It was a good time. They actually did interview somebody that walked in. They actually did interview somebody, pulled him back. And I'm like, I heard, I heard the whispering in the, in the, in the corners. And I watched them walk the person out. And then <laughs> what you never see is the managers be like, ha. Ah, Okay, let's go discuss that. And they ran off to another secret corner to talk about the interview. Who knows? I, I didn't see who they were talking to. Fascinating to see everything from all sides now. Man, I have more. No, I don't want Jinx that. I don't want Jinx that. Do I have more energy than I thought I would? Maybe. <laughs> Am I stalling? Yes, definitely. Am I stalling because my hands are not used to having work to do all of a sudden and are cracking apart and are in pain? Yes. And have I covered them with lotion? Yes. And am I terrified to get lotion grease all over everything I own? Not going to tell you. But am I stalling? Yes. Absolutely. <sighs> well, Sydney. Um. Mm. I almost have all of the Majora's Mask VODs uploaded. Almost all of them. And for the first time, you can actually go get them if you want to watch them. In two different places. If you check the game list. If you check the game list. Majora's Mask is on Twitch. Like everything else is. And it's on YouTube. If you guys like that. Then I'll put more stuff on YouTube. Just let me know. But that's almost all ready for you to watch. All of my highlights again. Before I make an actual highlight video. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, fifth grade today. 
sixth grade on Wednesday. And then October happens. And I have zero idea what we're doing for October. I will figure it out. I'll figure it out later. You'll never see it <gasps> oh! Aubrey, oh, thank you. <laughs> oh no. Here's a tip. <laughs> Don't split it with that other guy. Wait, wait, I need to read the message. Aubrey! That's incredible. Don't forget to hydrate. Say she your body's needs. Treat yourself. With the water, Aubrey. Oh, thank you so much. That's incredibly generous. Oh my gosh. I can totally hear the voice, the, 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 here's a tip. Love you, bud. Oh, no, thank you. Um, don't, don't, don't. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's going to help a lot. Um, I hope your thing is going well too. Uh, I hope that's going really well for you. It's the first payday coming up for me. I'm excited. <sighs> yeah, I, I like this. I like this work that we're doing. And I think I think. I think it's going to. Uh, I think it's going to complement the streaming pretty well. Because you know what? I'm here and y'all are here. And I did the thing today, so we're going to be good. I never saw it coming. Thank you for that tip. Oh, yeah. Boss lady moves. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Let's. Let's switch our monitor to 32 bit mode. Oh, that's right. We're going to use all 256 of those colors. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All 256 colors. Here we go. Do -do -do. Um, fifth grade. <laughs> Am I going to remember all this? We'll see. Okay. Ah. Pacific Ocean. Present day. Oh, wow. Look at those colors. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. A little to your left, Laugh Trap. There. There's another one, Santiago. Uh, yeah, Joni. <gasps> what is it? His eyes can glow? No. Laugh Trap, scoop up the artifact and head on back. Uh, scoop up the artifact, Laugh Trap. Fix mm. yourself, Laugh Trap. Blow dry my hair. <laughs> Oh, lap trap. We tolerate you. Look what we found, Captain Clark. <gasps> Another one. Oh. They certainly are peculiar, Joni. Maybe they're a clue to why so many ships have been disappearing. Santiago's face looks like the face. Hey, where's Owen, Leslie? He's helping the cook. Grandpa, I mean the captain, said it was okay. <laughs> Dude, sorry. There must have been too much yeast in that pizza dough. Captain! Island! Get ahead. Pizza Island! Well, finders, it looks like we found what we've been searching for. <gasps> this island isn't on any of my charts. Uh... Captain! A tsunami! Heading right for us! Tsunami? Not tsunami. Oh my gosh. Tsunami! Oh my gosh. Hard to port! Our only chance is to steer right into it. Dude, where's my board? Dude! That was extremely... You want to know what happens? Well, before you go on, you must use the keyboard and sign your name on this <gasps> piece of paper. Is this going to be a Greek mythology themed one? Oh, oh, his head is a volcano. Oh, oh, okay, okay. 
Well, I guess we're in it. The clue finders need your help. But beware, dark secrets are looming. <laughs> Actual disclaimer. You may tangle with giant sea creatures and need to cross rivers of boiling sulfur and lava. If you're ready for this mysterious adventure, sign your name below. Okay. Yeah. We only need to practice. This Greek. Hmm. I'm trying to remember the last fifth grade game. It was Joe Hammond. So that was a lot of, uh, it was like tetragrams. That was art history, a little bit of geography, some stacking, a little bit of fractions. Yeah, that's all I remember. Should be good. Hey, a surfboard. Oh no. What a tragic twist. Or Leslie. Oh dear. Or the captain. Yay. Or the crew. Yeah. What? It's just that? the. Oh. Hmm. Let's do a little seismic research. Yep. What? <laughs> just as I thought. That is an active volcano. <laughs> it charges yeah. off of the ground. It's gonna erupt really soon. Oh you no. Mean it's gonna blow. Let's get out of here. <laughs> It would appear that that method of escape will not be effective. Leslie, are you okay? Where are you? They're calling from a Pokedex. She's with me. Saved her life again. Ow. Hey. Some lifesaver. From all appearances, Owen and I are sequestered in some sort of subterranean chamber with no apparent means of egress. She means we're stuck under crown somewhere. <sighs> That's what I said. Any when did they? Where you are? Oh yeah, they turned into gods in the last one. Whoa! Look at all those artifacts. Thousands of them. Hi, goldfish. Welcome. The plot is happening very quickly. Hey, one fell off. Hi, hello. This is a clue. I'll analyze it and report back. Don't worry, you guys. We'll find you. And Grandpa. And the ship's crew. Uh, before the volcano blows? We'll observe you from this end on the red video phone. Video Call phone. Need help. Check. We'll use my backpack to store any clues or artifacts we find. Oh boy, here they go again. Oh, we're stuck well, with him. You need a break, let me know. Okay, Santiago. Where do we start? <sighs> you decide. The four clue finders are back at it again. And by four, I mean these two. Joni, do you feel like someone's watching us? I always feel like... Hi, goldfish. Um, how are you? Welcome in. We can go to the boat wreck. Or we can go to the island. <laughs> it's that four is not two. <laughs> it's that... Um... If we've learned anything from these games, it's do we believe in monsters rising from the sky. And we got the video phone. Um, bit boat wreck. Or, ooh, looks like polluted water. Ooh, that's fun. All right, which one first? Rising from the grave. Boat. 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 Is it boat? It is boat. Oh, there we go. Math! Hey, look! On the other side of this river. Shark math. Ship. What's left of it, anyway? Oh, gosh. Whoa, that's deep. Do you think we can make it? Uh, no way. Too dangerous. But I've got a plan. No way. Too I dangerous. I we can use these longer pieces of coral to build a bridge across the water to the other side. Coral. Uh, hey, uh, do you think these numbers mean anything? Probably. Let's find out. Please explain more. Seven plus three. Oh, oh. Oh, 
that connects like that. 7 plus 3, then 22 minus 3. Bam! Alright. Well, chat, play along, if you want. There's no way I can force you. Uh, if you see a match, if you can read it okay, let me know where to put it. You start Ah! It would've made more sense if it made it, like, basalt or something. <gasps> Is that that, like, um... That, like, hexagon-shaped black rock from Uncharted? Remember Uncharted 2? Or 3? Or 4? Remember all the Uncharted games have that, like, hexagon black rock? That's cool. <laughs> uh, I'll start from down here. So, chat, if you want to start from up here, we'll catch up. 6 plus 2 is 8. 22 minus 10 is... Yeah, there we go. Yellow pillar guy looks like a grenade. And he look... Uh, yeah, you know what? Hmm. Grenade waffle. It's all a matter of perspective, isn't it? Yes, I am correct. He <laughs> he. 41 minus 31 is 10. And 20 minus 12 is 8. Bam. 9 and 9, 18. 20. But bam. 6, 2 is 8. 8, 6, uh, yeah. But bam. 7, 6 is 13. Is there a 13 on here? There is. There's only one. I'm not even doing the est. Great. 13, 8, 21. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. 20 minus. Aha. Good thing these sharks are patient. 16 plus 5 is 21. Here we go. There's another 21 at the top. Thank you. Ooh, so what would go with that? The 14 and 7. Nice. Whoops. Okay. There. And now this one. 16 and 12 is... 28. Now this is hard to read. 42. Well. Looks safe. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> we did it. Let's go across. Did it, did you all see this is coral. This is coral. Did you all see magic dirt? It's coral. Did y'all see the Z Frank video on coral this week? I learned a lot of stuff from that one about how coral is actually a bunch of living things. It was neat. Magic dirt. <laughs> He's brilliant. Boy, <laughs> Creepy great. Dave. Hey, look, our scuba gear. Maybe we can sneak into the water down here. Maybe. Look. Uh, hey, it's one of those. <laughs> Cryptiles. And I would like just think that would thank you. Uh, Cryptiles. Yes, yes. I do love Cryptiles, but I'm afraid they don't love me. Go right through, actually. Are these crypto bros? Oh dear. Jackal worms, jackal worms. I yield one minute to manage a worm. Oh, thank you. <laughs> worms, as my esteemed colleague has so often pointed out, we live in troubled times. <laughs> Clearly stated in deposition A, heretofore noted in the prior deposition, with each new travel, we lose another colleague in our quest for inside. Stop the presses! Our quest for inside? What exactly is inside? Inside. 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 Permanently perched. Living Island? Living Island? There's no such thing. 
This island has a secret, and we're going to uncover it. There's no such thing as fish. Yes, you will be our emissaries to inside. Maybe inside is where Owen and Leslie are. The answers lie inside. This is why if his mouth insides aren't. Head to the fish within the fish. The what? Acid. Listen. Uh, come on, Joni. You heard the man. I mean the worm. It's cryptiles we need. Let's get a move on. They're hilarious. And oddly shaped. Hmm. Why is this by see through? Yep. Yep. LSD acid or hydrochloric? Like stomach acid. But mouth has ah. That's what I meant. <gasps> Inside. Dude, Tony. It's the mini sub. It's still working. Maybe you guys can take her out and get some help. Yes. Okay. Here we go. Back to Honolulu. Aloha. Hydrochloric. Aloha. That's I'm offensive. Not lab trap. I'm sure. The lab five is only designed for a range of three nautical miles. It is good for deep sea diving, but it will not take you very far. But it can take us down to the bottom of the seafloor to scoop up some of those cryptiles. Right. Come on, Santiago. Let's check out that sub. There goes my luau. <laughs> All right, so I do have a question. My question is, what is the difference between a regular mile and a nautical mile? Why do they have to specify nautical miles? What is the difference? Someone's still in one piece. Listen, Lab 5. Owen and Leslie are trapped. We've got to help them. Right, but we need cryptiles to do it. We need crypto. If you take us back down to the ocean floor, we'll scoop some more up. Oi, that tsunami was no picnic, you know. Oi. Bad shape. Oi. I don't know if I can make it. But Lab 5, you're our only hope. Well, if you can patch my electrical circuits, I'll make sure that you safely reach the ocean floor. Electrical circuits are Oy. my specialty. Oh, to are they? more cryptiles on the ocean floor, you'll have to reconnect the electrical power to my sonar circuit. Place a battery near the sonar circuit, and then use pieces of copper wire to connect the battery to the positive and negative terminals on the circuit. Make sure to choose the battery with the correct voltage. Okay. It can take you far. It can't take you far, but it can for sure go to the deep sea. We know that goes. Oh, no. A nautical mile is slightly longer than a mile on land. Why? Why have the... What? Land measured? Or stretch? Not only is based on Earth's longitude and latitude coordinates. Equating one minute. Okay. <sighs> oh, that makes sense. Defaulting to the thing that's larger on the Earth and takes more space. Makes sense. Hi, Seti! Thank you for confirming. Hi, how are ya? Six volts. Oh. Uh -hmm. You've connected the positive side of a battery. No, I didn't. And we're off. Oi, are my joints stiff? Oh, your joints are stiff? Your joints are stiff, Lab 5? Ooh. Oh, thank you for the crypto. Oi. To locate more cryptiles on the ocean floor, you'll have to reconnect the electrical power to my sonar circuit. We know There's how this works. You're hungry, but also and eating. Pieces of copper wire to connect the battery to the positive and negative terminals on the circuit. Make sure to choose the battery with the correct voltage. I think my advice to you, Seti, is continue. I think it's the best I can say. Continue. And the solution will reveal itself. It's good advice. <sighs> I 
positive. All right, here we go. All right. Let's hope I hold together. I sure hope so. Oh, look, it's still there. Yay. Well, we made it back just in time. I've just blown another circuit. <laughs> oh, no. To get the submarine moving. Got it. <laughs> oh, that's negative. Yeah, that's negative. You just had a doctor's appointment and got your flu shot today. Oh, no. You don't have any symptoms? You usually don't. Oh. Well, then, good. You should be eating and let, letting your body do the things that it needs to do. I feel like a hundred bucks. Well done. Dive, <gasps> dive, dive. I also feel like a hundred bucks because chat's so nice. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you again. Ah. Hi, hi, hi. I guess I'm not as young as I used to be. I've blown another circuit. Die, die, die. To be able to locate more cryptiles in the darkness of the depths, you'll have to reconnect the power to my searchlight. Place a battery near the light, and then use pieces of copper wire to connect it to the light. She has some major fuse issues. Yeah. I can totally see who this would be as a person, though. I know people like this. Die, die, die. And She's not Boy, Reaper. Are my joints stiff? Boy. <sighs> Y'all, did, did I mention I can't? Oh. <gasps> Shares complete. basic frozen burritos. I, <clears throat> seem to need some more Chat, eat up. We can descend again. Social battery. I, oh, no. I want my old before we can safely descend to the ocean floor, oh no! We'll have to reconnect the electrical power to my life support circuit. Uh, Place a battery near the life support circuit, and then use pieces of copper wire to connect. The that's a very the important. Oh my gosh! Okay, Subnautica, Just deliver it, deliver it, chill. It's fine. Right, here we oh go. gosh! Let's hope I hold together. <sighs> hi hi. Battery set, social battery. Oh. Man, tomorrow is going to be the real test of my social battery, y'all. Well, we made it back just in time. I've just blown another circuit. Oh, good. I've been dreading tomorrow to more for a while. Floor, you'll have to reconnect the electrical power to my sonar circuit. I have to wake up. Stop. Sonar circuit. Stop. I have to wake up at six. No. Let's wake up before six. I start at six. I end work at two. I'm going to take a nap. And then I'm going to go dancing for, th for three to five hours. So that nap is going to be a very important nap right there in the middle. So we're going to hope to make that happen. That's my plan. What are y'all doing tomorrow? Bip, bip. Bip, bip. I feel like a hundred bucks. Well done. Dive, dive, dive. That's a very quiet V, Goldfish. That's so much chancing? Not really. Not really. Um, I mean, we start at 7 and then we go till like 10.30. Usually. I guess I'm not as Every week. As I used to be. That's not a lot. Circuit. That's, that's, that's the easy part. It's if my body will allow me... Stop. If my body will allow me to do so. Oh, they're doing construction outside. I'm like, what are those sounds? You am. Probably go die, die, die. No, dive, dive, dive. Working. <gasps> How nice for us all to be wor hey, working. It really does feel weird to be back into it. To be back in the labor force. Oh, I see. Oh. Oh, no. That works. Oi, are my joints stiff? Oi. We don't know how many we need. But we're learning, apparently. Seven. <laughs> Docking complete. Unfortunately. 
Unfortunately, I <clears throat> seem to need some more repairs before we can descend again. Connections are matched. Oh, hmm. I want my old hull back. <gasps> What's that? Oh, the before propeller. You safely descend to the ocean floor, you'll have to. Ba -bow. Oh. No, 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 bow, ba bow, ba bow, and a ba bow. Right, here we go. Let's hope I hold together. Let's hope. Ooh, I don't remember what grade it was, but like the first time I ever soldered something was around this time period. Third, fourth, fifth grade. There was an after school electronics class. Hey, okay. <gasps> 24. Whoa. You were in seventh in shop class. See, I had metal shop. I feel like a hundred bucks. Well done. In eighth dive, grade. Dive, dive. But no, we definitely like soldered circuits in elementary school. You never soldered anything. I have not since then. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm not I'm not a crafty guy. I'm not hand handy with anything. I guess I'm not as young as I used to be. Learned to I weld a knife. Chat, I'll give you each Whoa. I'll give you each one guess of the reason why I took metal shop. I was offered plastic shop and I was offered wood shop. I'll give you all one guess each why I chose metal shop instead. And we're up. Oi, you learned a well from dad. <gasps> Only in passing. Whoa. We had a neighbor um that was a welder. And they made a they made a speed racer helmet for a cosplay of mine. Your dad is a metalwork professionally. You were excited to le learn. Oh, nice! You get to make a knife. Okay, that's a good guess. Docking complete. <gasps> Whoa! I, um... Look at all of our crafts, fam. Look at all of our <laughs> look at all of our craft dads. Look at all our craft dads in chat. How many do we have? Ten. All right, I'm done. A map. You can use it to travel to locations you've been to before. Dad Weld Carpenter. Ooh. I say, young fellows, still looking for crypt tiles? The principal facts in this case show that you have yet to complete your quest for inside at the fish within the fish. I don't know how many I need. Uh, you chose Metal Shop because it sounded more dangerous. Ah, another good guess. Welding is the biggest dad thing, according to chat. <laughs> Rin, do you wanna do you wanna offer a guess of the single reason I chose Metal Shop? Ooh. Hello. Oh my. Who? What are you? I am Tube. Who are you? We're the clue finders. Clues? You seek clues? Actually, we seek cryptiles. Mm-hmm. You know about cryptiles? Cryptiles awfully hard to swallow. I have a cryptile stuck in my throat. Now, if the rest of my body were working, that is, if my tubes connected, I could cough it up. Excuse me. This is just one guy. Place. Lap trap. It's still a cryptile. Metal. My tube segments are all mixed up. Segments. Rearrange my tube segments to make three more complete tubes, and I can cough up this cryptile for you. To make a complete tube, the frictions on the two segments. Segments. Must segments. Add up one. One. These actors are having a blast. Your dad did as part of his auto repair stuff. Ooh. Your brain just went to the joke reason of because metal music. Sadly, I was not as putty as a little kid. Uh, as I am now. You don't like the clear tubes. The true answer is. It's my drum roll. Because I wanted to make Cloud's shoulder piece. From Final Fantasy. Not his sword, because I knew that'd be happening eventually, and too much. I wanted to make the shoulder piece. So I learned to make a toolbox and a chisel. I didn't make a knife, but I did make a file. 
Um, and I was not good at any of it, but they all still work. You're not surprised. So you're all on the right track. Very fair. Thank you. Oh, okay. Ew! Listen, listen to the sound of connection. Open your ears. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I seem to have another crepitile stuck in my air tubes. Air tubes. Oh, no. And my segments are once again scrambled. Segments. He just. He just ejected it toward us. Um. I don't know how many we need. Or if they're the same thing. I guess we're leaving? Wow. Ew. A wall of cryptiles. I wish we could take them, but those cryptiles look like they're on there pretty tightly. Uh, you know, it's not really that the cryptiles are under the rocks and seaweed. You're right. It's more like the rocks and seaweed are on top of the cryptiles. Yeah, and sometimes a house burns up and sometimes a house burns down. You guys don't have a clue as to what's going on, do you? We have lots of clues, just no answers. Yet, but we're working on it. Come on, Santiago, there's no time to lose. Lap Trap isn't wrong, but Lap Trap is never... Oh, what's the word? Oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Lap Trap is never... Enjoyable. Wow. Look at that! The island has no bar. I mean, it has no. It's not a. You mean it's floating? Right! Fish within the fish. Fish within the fish. <laughs> Could this be the place the worm was talking about? Uh, I don't know. Let's find out. Are they not allowed to say the word? Wait. Wait, am I not allowed to say the word? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what's going on here? Why can't we say the word? Laugh trap. Laugh trap, did you call four kids to censor us so we can't say the word? Oh no. Fish our friends, not food. Welcome to the jaws of the fish within the fish. For ages past, our school has guarded the entrance to inside and challenged all trespassers to this deep corridor. By what arrogance do you think that you will not drown in our mighty jowls? Listen, we're the clue finders. And when someone takes our friends, we find them, period. Well, arrogance indeed. <laughs> but to pass through and arrogance. enter inside, you must first unlock our challenge. Only with a wealth of turquoise cryptiles can you begin. Hey, Joey, do you have any turquoise cryptiles in your backpack? Oh, they're different colors. Yeah, I see some turquoise cryptiles. Let's take them out. Okay, now what do we do? You are now ready to risk life and limb. Take note of the eight slots in the wall below. Each must be filled using a cryptile that matches the word below it. Oh. Once all eight are filled, the first part of your challenge will be complete. But our cryptiles only have these strange symbols on them. How can we match them to the words? My powers are great. I read all <laughs> languages of the deep, including this one. Place any cryptile into my mouth, and I will translate it into your language. He's great. I like him. 
Fires remind you of Link Faces of Evil. Did you just watch the completionist episode on Faces of Evil? Do we all have the same YouTube feed? Uh, it's probably because of these five faces right here. They're pretty good. Get out of here. I'm gonna call him Chomper. Arrogance! You haven't watched it yet? You mean to though. Hey! I will now explain the true heart of the challenge. After you translate all your cryptiles, you will still need to transform their words. To transform the word on a cryptile, use the fish to my left and right. Each of the fish will transform a word according to the rule on its head. Experiment with each of the fish to discover exactly what each rule means. To perform a transformation, place a cryptile into one of the fish's mouths. But beware. You may transform a cryptile only four times before it disintegrates. Okay, music feels a bit Zelda too. Oh. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not bad yet. Um, repay, prepay, pays. Those are the only three words. Are any of those related to these? No. Do they have a different voice? Aha! You have made a new word. Ooh. Uh, okay. A fine word. What? Invent. Reinvent. Pre-invent? <laughs> Is that a word? High tide, low tide. These words are my pride. I pre-reinvented that idea. What is... It just says past. Like past tense? We should probably translate everything first. Past tense. Oh, that was like past payment. Premium inventing is just inventing. Okay, let's, let's test that out. Arranged. Occupy, you did. Preoccupied. Oh! Oh! I didn't even notice that. They're the same ones on the. Oh! My bad. That's what we're trying to do. Yes. There's a recycle mark. Oh! Yes. Well, none of those. Hey, great way to get rid of those crypt tiles you never want to see again. Thanks, dude. Cryptiles to proceed. So I used four of them. I used. Okay. Okay. Close backpack. Invent. One set is four. Okay. Tell me if you see. Chat, will you please tell me if you see the base word for any of these? Cook. Decorate. Invent is not there. Cook is one. Okay. Cook it. Three cook it. 
precedent. Your wisdom is great. Decorated. That's it. Okay. Bye. Right. Cool. My wisdom is great. Oh, one set is four. So it doesn't matter. Why is Invent still there? Create. Now he understands. Yeah. So, really what it's telling me is that in each set, there's only going to be one correct one. Okay. Wow. These are like a gotcha odds. But hey, what is Clue Finders if not you may reach inside yet. really stretched out? <coughs> okay. What is Clue Finders if not grind? Can I just feed him the raw turquoise? No. No. Recalls. Okay. I'm like, it's not going to give me zero options, right? Surely it wouldn't waste my time like that, right? Clue grinders, am I right? Give yourself a badum. That was really good. Ten of these four got here. Yep. Oh, thanks! Anyway. Nice. Eat these. Okay. Direct. Redirects. You will soon reach your goal. I kind of like that it's called inside. That's cute. And mysterious. Arrange. Record. Pre recorded. remain eat I don't know if I like that they wriggle into his mouth like spaghetti I don't know if that's my favorite thing wait a second I haven't um, select pre-selects press elects Made of paper. Success is close at hand. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, I wonder if this one's a range. Create. Oh, look, we got pay again. Mm, they can only do so much programming for this game. They can only do so much. Oh, create. You have no idea what's even happening. Link in the faces of evil. We had to go to the submarine to get these things, which are written in that language. And then we find this guy who is blocking the way inside of these bubbles, because that's inside. This guy says he can speak every language so we feed these stone slabs into his mouth and he translate them for us. Then we have to alter them into letter, into different words to fit this. And then whatever Sati said. Pay. 
Is this gonna be wash? Did wash? What if it's actually deep speech? Conducting experiments, and we think we've got something for this. Is a microwave My dinner analysis indicates the following it's as tough as steel, but as light as plastic, and it bounces. See, you have performed admirably so far, but your Sweet task loaf. is not yet complete. What you will now need jade cryptiles to proceed. Hey, Joni, do you have any jade cryptiles in your backpack? Yup, I see some jade cryptiles. Well, let's take them out. Making a long time. That's clearly two. This is clearly two tiles, right? No one's gonna argue with that. So when I put this here, it should be at least two, if not more. Hey, it's four. Synonym. Oh, listen to the slurp sound. Is fulfill down here? Of course not. Collect. So don't forget that. I will try not to. You make it pretty often, honestly. Uh, is this cheap and easy? It's not summer? Mix house. Oh. Accomplish is probably our word. Think. Accomplish. Achieved. <gasps> Achieves. Aha! Aha! Made a new word. Thank you. I wonder. A fine word. Thanks. I wonder if there are any uh, viewers that are like actually learning from this, because I tune into some French streams sometimes to practice, and I wonder if the font size on the screen is good enough where we could actually be teaching somebody anything at all, or if yes. I'm yes. Fulfill. Represent. Collect. Acquire. Pretty decent. Okay. Thank you. <gasps> oh, no. You am? You am? I'm sorry. Is that not right? Gather. Thanks, Sislexia. Oh, you are learning. Oh, sorry, I meant that you're on mobile. You are learning? Yay! Yay! Yeah, look, you can tell how many times it's been changed by the by the sides. Well. Bye, I guess. Time to go back to the tube! Which way, Joni? Goodbye. Take the mini sub out for a run? No. Hmm. I say, young fellows, still looking for cryptiles? The principal facts in this case show that you have yet to complete your quest for inside. They changed names to the kids back. Were you here for the fourth grade one? Oh, good. In the pyramid? Back with long, thin, and gross. I am tube. <laughs> Rearrange my tube segments. <gasps> three more complete tubes. I am. Um... Cop up this cryptile for you. Cryptile. A complete tube. Tube. Versions on the tube segments must add up to one. Segments. Hilarious. His tube segments! Crepitile! 
It's the blue ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They changed the names of the kids. Joni. Uh, in the UK version, was he was she Josie? Santiago. You know what? They're just the blue one, the red one, and the two that aren't in the game. Tube. Yeah. He was Sebastian in the UK version. And fourth. One, two, three. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that not good enough for you? Okay, let's try that again. You did it. Here, have this. <laughs> Yeah, that's one. That's one right there. One, two, three, four. And my seconds are once again scrambled. Oh, I don't like how that seventh one is looking. Eugh. All right, bud. Oh no. The one you can't change obviously doesn't count. Not obviously! He's a tube! That was never obvious. Oh no. This is not good. Oh no. Oh no. Don't cough at me. Move one fourth on top of one thing. Yeah, you know, I'd really like to. I'd really like to. I'd really like to play this game. Well. Yikes. That's right. for you to make a complete tube got it <laughs> we're all the fifth okay Getting frustrated. One, two, three, four. Okay. One fifth. There. No, one fourth. There you go. Pew. Two, thanks. <laughs> I seem to have another crepitile stuck in my air tubes. Oh no. And my segments are once again scrambled. Not your segments. I tubes. <laughs> eh. I seem to have another crepitile stuck in my air tubes. Air tubes. Oh no. Oh and no. Oh no. Oh goodness. No. 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 
I say no! <laughs> oh, that's good. One fourth, one fourth. Uh. Gosh. You did it! Four. I seem to have another crepitile stuck in my air tubes. Oh, oh no. Two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I'll do it. Did it? Does that just have it? I just like listening to him. Is that okay? <laughs> oh no, the 14th. Oh no, it's harder now. Oh no. Oh no. Oh goodness. Three, eleven, four, five, six. You can't divide an 11th. Three. What if I just find all the elevenths and hope for the best? Yep, that'll work. Oh no. Four fourteenths. What? 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 Oh no. One, two. You. You did it. Good eye. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I seem to have another crepitile stuck in my air tubes. Oh. oh! He says, oh! Oh, okay. I'll take that. I'll take that too. One, two, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Come on. This doesn't work. Five fifteenth is one third. What have we done? Half plus eight fifteenths. Your game doesn't work. Fifth grade? Yes, fifth grade made this game. Oh. Let's do half and half. There's no half of a 15th. 
Oh, I can remove them? Oh, I thought they were stuck. I thought they were stuck. You did it. Cool. Okay, good, 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 good. <laughs> I seem to have another reptile stuck in my air tubes. Too bad. You moved them before? I didn't notice they've been stuck. Bam, bam, bam. You have returned! And the challenge continues! I think. What? Okay. Stain? Alright, help me out, chat, if you can see the words. Collect, fulfill, and. I help, thank you. Oh, good eye. A synonym for stain is taint. You put that in the past tense, tainted. Your wisdom is great. Then we throw out the rest of the words. I mean, recycle them. I love having to click the backpack every time. You know what? Actually, I'm just gonna leave that up there. <laughs> Surprise. Design. Display. Represent. Startled. Surprise and startle. Startled. Past tense. It just goes, goes into his teeth. You may. Divide. Represent. Design. Oh, separate. Divide and separate. That's synonyms. And guess what? We're doing past tense again. Thanks. Tube. Design. Fulfill. Examine. <sighs> Examine is a cinnamon roll of investigated. Perfect. Clever. Thanks. I find this much more enjoyable as a game. It's a vocabulary lesson you can do by testing. Yeah. Yeah. I have no issue. Well, no, I don't really have any issues with the game so far. It's kind of Montessori style. Gain. Acquire. I'm sorry. I'm still upset that collect doesn't mean gain. Only two slots remain. Thank you. Segments. Not being clear, you can still move them. Yes. That's fine. We figured it out. Gain and the collector not the same thing. Are you sure? Smile is a synonym of grimmed. Past tense of grin. Was happy. Success is close at hand. Or in my case, Finn. Finn. Mood. Represent. Sprinkle. Sprinkle! Drizzle. Sprinkle and drizzle are cinnamon rolls of each other. And past tense. You can collect your gains and you can gain a collection, but they're never the same. 
<laughs> the same. Whoops. Hmm, that word looks interesting, but unfortunately, it is not a real word. Drizzles is. <laughs> oh no. Drizzles is in it. Oh no. Hey, who do we have to go say hi to? Something behind all this. The question is what? Or Chat. Who? who do we have to go talk to? He's sticking his mouth and it turns its first form. You can find out. Oh, good. We're back with long, thin, and gross. I am cube. Uh, see, I thought that would be what the recycle button does, is refresh it back to what you had. But nope. What else we thought? Yep, instead recycle is actually just throwing away. Is there another ninth? Thanks. <laughs> I seem to have another crepitile stuck in my air. Crepitile? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Thanks, Tube. You're the worst. No, Claptrap is the worst. Be nice to Tube. You have returned. No. And the challenge continues. You need Jade Cryptiles to proceed. Hey, Joey. Let me play. There we go. Phlegm covered Cryptiles. Oh, is that why they're Jade? You're right. All right, let's do represent. symbolizes it takes two nope good to know for when everybody else starts playing this game Challenges still await you. Many. Okay, we're back with more helpful information from Mr. Owen Lamb, Super Detective. Yeah, right. Okay, my research indicates that the mysterious writing on these cryptiles is not from any known recorded language, ancient or modern. Big deal. Here's something really cool. Cha. <laughs> they taste great. Now take note. No longer are the rules shown upon the fish's heads. Now you must experiment with each fish to discover its rule. Beware! You will need both jade and turquoise cryptiles to complete this part of the challenge. Let's get to work, Santiago. Hey, Joni, do you have any cryptiles in your backpack? Check. Well, let's take them out. Owen is the reason that the Nintendo Switch cartridges taste bad. Owen is the reason. You're right. Brutal. Avoid? Hmm. 
That word looks interesting. That's not but fair. Unfortunately, it is not a real word. That's not fair. We can experiment. I should have experimented with the. Hmm, that word has a yep. nice sound to it. Yeah, I see what you've done. Yep. Yep. Remover. A fine Ooh. word. We're never going to use that one. Nope. Never. Cool. Anyway. Cool. Fourth is err. Oh, is it a void again? Thank you. Am I still been able to do it? No. Uh, uh. <gasps> oh. By changing it to on. Wait. Oh, no, they're not. No, 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 no. They're not synonyms. They're antonyms. Thanks. All right. Let's do four of this. Where's the tube? Where's the tube? Four of this and three of the Hello, other one. Hello, Tubi. How's it going? Tubi. I am Tube. Rearrange my tube segments. Four eighths, five eighths. Three more complete tubes, and I can cough up this crypt. This crypt. Un yes, that's right. Thank you. Yes. Five twelfths. Okay. Don't cough at me, sir. You did it! <laughs> I see you have another crepitile stuck in my air tubes. Air tubes. Oh no. Oh, no. He's hilarious. Four, five, six tenths. Seven tenths, eight tenths, nine tenths, ten tenths. Y'all enjoying this? Are we interacting enough? You having a good time? Everyone? So we need three blue. Four, not three. Yes, that's right, that's right. Thank you. Do I have 14th to spare? I do. Oh. Oh no. Okay. Yeah. Oh, they are covered in phlegm. You're right. I see. Fifteenths. No, those fifteenths. You did it. Okay, one more of these forever, I hope. <laughs> I seem to have another crepitile stuck in my air tubes. <laughs> oh no.
Can I do another fourth? Okay. Oh, no, there's a tenth. Okay. Yes. Yes. Goodbye forever, tube. <laughs> I seem to have another crepitile stuck in my air tubes. I'm going to tell my kids this is a Starian. My circuits ache. Before we can safely descend to the ocean floor, you'll have to reconnect the oh, to my, my aching tentacles. And we're up. Oi, are my joints stiff? I'm curious if hold on. <laughs> Unfortunately, I <clears throat> seem to need some more repairs before we can descend again. Um I'm curious what chat thinks. Is this game tr like this mini game right here truly easier than tube? All right, here we go. Or do you think it's up to the person whether they're better at math or logic or like circuitry? I'm curious if people can do the other one as fast as I can do this one. Well, we made it back just in time. For the person? I've just hmm. blown another circuit. I've just blown another circuit. Whoops. Well, double circuits. <clears throat> You've... All right. I feel like a hundred bucks. Well done. Really? Dive, dive, dive. Why does that work like that? I guess oh, that's I'm all of them. As I used to be. I've blown another circuit. Yeah. Oh, we don't need life support. Bye. I mean. Oops. Returned, and the challenge continues. Yes. <coughs> okay. Let's move that up there. Loosen. Avoid. Succeed. And free. Okay, what's the opposite of loosen? Titan? Free, do you think? Is it freeing? Could be tie. Bind. Aha! You have made a new word. Thanks. We'll need it anyway. Ah, loosen and tie. Uh-oh, un? Ding. Do you think that they saved this? Do you think they saved this? Uh... The reason they have this difficulty level planned in here is because the English language is too hard to explain the rules of. So instead of just putting the hints on the foreheads, it's way too hard to explain how 
the verb T-I-E actually becomes T-Y when you add an I-N-G to it, but only for this one. <gasps> no. That cryptile was no! beyond its limits of transformation. Oh my gosh. Has disintegrated. Oh good. We're back with long, thin, and gross. Great. I, I am tube! <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. you have another crepitile stuck in my air tube. Sorry. Okay, okay, okay. You have returned, and the challenge continues. Detach, extend, succeed, and free. Fold. Folding. Unfolding. Tricky. Thanks. Nope. Loosen. Aha. So what happened? We had to go get another. You was looking at food, like ordering food. I had the word untying. Instead of putting it here, I put it right here. And he wouldn't give it back. Yeah, that's what happened. You may reach inside yet. While I was making a brilliant observation on grammar. Also. That's what happened. Repair damage. Damaging. You are. You are. Thank you. You are. Superstar. Hollywood treasure. You are. Cinema. The cinema. Deflate. Inflate. Inflating. <sighs> okay. You yes. Will soon. Man, chat. I thought this would happen because I chose to take a little nap before streaming today after work, but I didn't eat. It's my fault. Detach. Didn't change the actions of these return. I got sir. I know. I mean, I, well, what am I gonna do? I only have limited time that I need to stream. Because I have to wake up super early, but I have to be fifth grade. I have to. I have a banana that I could start. I have a. I have a chilled banana I could start thawing and I can eat on the next set of mini games probably. Only 
two slots remain. No, it's not. No, it's not. You don't get paid to eat. It's capitalism. I got whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> That's not very capitalist of y'all. Okay, smart used. Whoa. No. No, no, no. Y'all wouldn't want that. <laughs> Eat. Right, hold on, hold on. I'll go. I'll go start thawing it. I'll leave it out for a little bit. Remove. We start an ad break. Um, hack. Oh, reveal cover. Oh, okay. I know. I want to see what the. Mm, right before I finish the last one, I'll I'll take it out of the fridge, and then we'll start that process of eventually eating it. No! The crypto Good. Success is close at hand. Mm -hmm. In my case, Finn. Finn. You just send you food? No, 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 no. This is me. It's because I... <sighs> it's my first day. First, not first day. It's my first week in like 18 months. It has nothing to do with me. What? what? Scatter pack. I didn't plan. Like, I've tried to plan the best, but I have a crazy schedule. Let's put my friends to fun streamers. <laughs> we'll all get there. What? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? What it, how cool all of us being retired is going to be like? What do, what do retired people even do right now? Like, bingo? Knitting, okay, we, a lot of people in our, in our ages knit. Thrown through a fit for you, so banana? Thrown? What are you, what are you, what are you thrown in? Tweet, uh, you guys have been retired for ages and he still works out on the side all the time? Yeah. No, 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 that's not the point I'm thinking. I'm saying all the cool stuff. We're going to be like watching our friends like stream from the retirement home. We'll be like playing D and D It's going to be cool. Play golf a lot. Okay. We're going to be doing cooler stuff when we're old. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. The grandma who plays. Yes, 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 yes. We're all going to be cool like that. So don't worry, Sethi. One day we'll all be able to treat each other. Uh, because we'll be old. <laughs> okay. I'm going to thaw the banana. Don't worry. Just love the Skyrim grandma. Tell us your favorite Skyrim grandma story. I'll be right back. I don't... Well, I, I can't... I can't control all my stuff with this game running. I don't think I have the be right back button. I could. Oh. Oh, yeah. Tell me your favorite Skyrim grandma story. I'll be right back. Oh no! Oh! No! What? That's a dumb idea. That was nowhere close. I can't skip this. I'm not having it. I'm not having it. Come on, snake! Whoop! 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 Are you kidding? Dang it! Dang it! Open up! Oh my God! Shoot! I had to die. God! Why would you turn right away? Oh my god. No! No, 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 no! Ah! Ah! Mm -hmm. Well. Now it gets real. Oh! Oh! Who did this? Who did this? I'm gonna slam. Welcome. Welcome to the jam. Hello, let's see if we have 
problem, officer. Oh, this? This? Oh, this is just a, uh, uh, don't mind me, this is just a hairdryer with a, with a trigger. That's all. Just, uh, not, not a weapon. It's just a typical run-of-the-mill grooming object. Oh, and that, that, that's a, that's a bowling ball with a fuse? Yeah. That's just, just for competitive bowling. You know. You know. Adds a time limit to things. Definitely not weapons. This is the most high-risk gameplay on my channel. Ah, indeed. Yep. And by locked, what I mean is... run an ad work it might not have worked because I was on the wrong screen and that's probably my fault sorry until you have a sub I don't think it ran um go ahead refund yourself refund yourself I decided it to not let the banana thaw because I'm like why would I wait for it to get mushy I can deal with it it will be solid I forgot the fact that it's still cold right on my teeth I forgot about that but we're good the banana chips yeah except it's cold <laughs> We put in ice cream like that? Oh, really? Man. When this first paycheck, not when this first paycheck comes through. Like nine paychecks from now, I'm gonna be buying so many snacks that I can just like eat whenever I want. <gasps> I can just like have them. That will be so cool. Let's take frozen, yeah, this wasn't frozen banana. No, nah. this is refrigerated banana. It's different. Mash them in some milk. Oh, like an ice cream maker. Oh, okay. Cool. Cold. Cold. All right. Ooh, chat, place your bets. Place your bets. Are these sharks going to make me do this one more time or not? Yes? <laughs> well, we will see. Unpacking. Hey guys, you made it through. That's Shh. awesome. Yes. I hear something. Uh guys, I don't think we're alone in here. Unyielding? Well, we solved this part of the mystery. Let's Un head back to the beach to find <laughs> more clues. Unclasping. Wait, you solved this part and you're not going through the gate you just opened? Okay. We're not alone. Back to the beach. Back to the beach, Samurai Jack. We're back at the beach. Which way should we go now, Joni? We've got to find Owen and Leslie. Let's get going. What is that? 
What is that? Okay. Don't worry about it. I guess. Hollywood trip. Oh well, <laughs> there's no crossing here. What are you talking about, Lab Trap? We can just hop over these rocks. Joni, no. Oh boy. Hey, look! The water's receding. Help! Uh, guys, I don't know what you're doing up there, but whatever it is, it's flooding our chamber with boiling water. Uh, Joni, get back here. Hmm, look, the water's coming back. Looks like you guys will have to find another way to cross. Boiling hey, lemonade. If we can move some of those longer rocks into place, we can use them to hop across the river. But look at the markings on these rocks. I wonder if they mean anything. Let's find out. Again. Peep, humans are unique to one another. <laughs> so this may be <clears throat> difficult for somebody else. But it feels like the math version of this is way harder. That might just be me. That might just be me. Just say. Maybe. Triangle. Bam. Octagon. Trapezium. Well, we've formed a section of the bridge, but I'm not sure that's the right rock to place there. Oh. Oh no, did I just boast about my... oh no. Uh-oh. 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 Nah. Mmm, corn. Um. Um. Uh. Um. Options here. Uh oh. That's correct, isn't it? And then there, yeah, and then. Um. Uh oh. No, that's the opposite. Oh no! Oh. A little pointless to go across the bottom at all. Good point. <laughs> we did it. And now we can cross. I just want to be a completionist. Okay. Clap. Thank you. Claptrap is so necessary. Dreaded living island. Living island? 
islands just aren't alive. It's a scientific impossibility. It's... Then explain holes that move and rocks that breathe. Well, now, uh, what did you say? <laughs> but don't. We're the clue finders. We're... Who says you? Volcano says I. Volcano says you. Eruption says I. Aye, but sure, the volcano's not our true enemy. The secret to this living island lies below. Nearly all of me fellow castaways have been sucked in, lost to the ravenous hunger of this living island. Hey, Joni. Take a look at his uh, weapon. It looks like one of those. Cryptile screams I. <laughs> the key to the mystery. Cryptile. I bring as many as you can to the faces within the face. The faces within the face. I use the cryptiles wisely, and the chamber will open. <laughs> chamber. I wonder if that's where Wait a second. Did I not I didn't explore like the bigger fish within the fish. I might need to go. That's a pose. That's a posture check. That's a kid. If you find a crazy man in the middle of the jungle, he's taking talking like an insane person. Maybe don't bring up why he's scientifically wrong. The asteroids are actually in retrograde, sir. I hate that when he makes certain mouth shapes, he suddenly only has two teeth. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> it's that goldfish. It's either that or the gaping holes. I don't know which one's worse. Oops. Wow. That looks like an American village from the Revolutionary War era. But where are all the people? And where are all the turtles? Come on. Let's Shut. Go. Sorry, Whoa. Look, Santiago, <gasps> Riptiles. We'll find our missing friends yet. Johnny, <gasps> wait. It could be dangerous. <gasps> she's, she's totally a thief. Sati, it's part of the curriculum. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I knew you wouldn't get my cryptiles. Who are you? I'm the great cryptile thief. I stole everybody's cryptiles and buried them in this patch of dangerous trees. The Christian now, Slater. The pillory. I got caught. Look, all my neighbors <sighs> have disappeared around here, and I'm ready to fess up, okay? I'll show you how to get the cryptiles out of this patch of trees if you promise to help find my fellow villagers. You set them free, they set me free. Deal. How will we know who they are? Well, our ancestors got what is his face here around the time of the Revolutionary War. What? You can't miss them. <laughs> Bifocals, kites, powdered wigs. Oh no. Okay, deal. Now, how do we get to the cryptiles without doing a tango with one of the ugly trees? I'll show you. <laughs> what? Hey, soup bowl, how about pulling that map down? Great. I'm taking orders from a criminal. A reformed criminal. <gasps> See, I use this old sea map in place of a map of my field. <laughs> Pretty clever, huh? Well, maybe. Is the guy in the corn? <laughs> too clever. I can't quite seem to remember how this map works. Uh, wait. Uh, it, it's beginning to come back. Okay. Uh, that red okay. dot shows where we are. And that X marks the spot where this is five o'clock shadow. Buried. Oh, and at the top of the map, there's an important warning. Be sure to follow what it says. No, no, that's okay, not a five o'clock shadow. Started, pick up those blocks with directions on them and place them in the sign to the left of the map. No, that's you not need a to fill in all the spaces on the sign buddy. in the correct order to dig make a joke a here. Cryptile. Trying to be hilarious. He's not a, a five o'clock chat. What is that? He's one of those, you know those half and half cookies? You know, you know those half and half cookies? <laughs> boom, don't boom. This is literally just North America. It's old, see? When I was in Heather's in 1985, this reference still didn't make sense. Uh, uh, 
I kind of want to do this a little bit later. I want to see if I can test like Bennett or any of our other viewers on this one. Cause that'd be fun. Anyway. What was that? Hey, Joni, look at this. It looks like someone fell in. A hat. Guess they were in a hurry. I saw the loading screen. I don't know if chat saw it. My screen went black, my cursor became a loading screen, and then there was a scream. Oh, never mind. Nothing to see here. Moving on. within the face, Santiago. Right. Let's hope the Cryptiles will help us unlock this mystery. I don't this know what you're talking dangerous. about. Why don't I just wait here and... <gasps> ah, I'll come, I'll come. Okay, there's no reason to go there yet. Wow. That looks like an American village from the Civil War era. But it's in ruins and drenched in rain. Oh, great. Rust. Come on, let's investigate. <laughs> well, you listen here, Mr. Island. It's a good thing I like rain. <laughs> and fish. Who's she talking to? Shh. The island, I think. But tomorrow is another day. So if you could be a good little island and rain somewhere else for a change. Joni, something's fishy. I mean, rain in only one spot? And fish rain. Civil War, the map. No, 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 no. There was two different wars Powerful discussed. Storms sometimes suck seawater and fish into their funnels, then rain. Fish and all. Oh. Hundreds of miles away. Well, Mr. Island, your rain doesn't bother me one little bit. But it's ruining the stories my ancestors wrote on these cryptiles. Cryptiles? Ma'am, we could use cryptiles. Well, I'd give you some. I'd give you but some. I must read these stories before the rain ruins them. <sighs> we can help you there. I adore the kindness of strangers. Come and I'll show you. Blanche Dubois reference. Okay. <gasps> I see what you mean about faces of evil. Yes. Yes. That's exactly how the cutscenes are animated. That's exactly right. They just go, yep, I get it. I get it now. Rain is going to ruin the cryptiles. They bounce. Gaping hole number one. Gaping hole number two. Fish. Fish. Come to my table and we'll get to work. Oh, you mean in there? Trying. Um, goldfish, it's, uh, yeah, the last guy was Revolutionary War. And now we're in Civil War. So this whole half of the island is just all U.S. history put together. All of it. All the important parts. Cryptiles are things that we literally put underwater. Fish's mouth. She don't know that. Well, you see, I've got all these mixed up cryptiles with parts of stories written on them. Some of these stories tell the history of my great great grandparents who were shipwrecked here right after the American Civil War. And some tell the stories of the other poor castaways who've been caught in the snare of this living island. If I could only put the cryptiles That's together a good point. in the right order, That's a good perhaps point. I'd be able to find a clue to help solve the mystery of this island. <laughs> I know that I have the right cryptiles here for two stories, one under <laughs> each title. But I don't know which cryptiles belong to which story. And I don't know what order the cryptiles are supposed to be in. Don't worry, we'll figure it out for you. <gasps> Why, thank you. You know, and if you she... think you've got both stories straightened out, hand me my handkerchief, and I'll wrap up a sack of cryptiles for you. If she's <laughs> colorblind... If storm doesn't get us first. This whole thing makes sense. That way, otherwise, yeah, yeah. I failed 50 on there. We didn't have all... Yep. But the map guy was a descendant. 
Similarly, he's current information. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's true. That's true. But that's a very good question. I, I think you would get extra credit if you, if you pointed that out. Okay. Well, chat, are we ready to learn about... Civil War Blanche's uh, descendants story and then some other person's story. I'm a little scared how these are going to turn out. Out of order, not just on the wrong side. Okay, cool. How does the story start? I would like to tell you about my last days in Philadelphia before setting forth on this voyage one year ago. In November of 1782. My printer's guild has... Oh, oh, those are connected. My printer's guild has just created the great seal of our United States of America. Mr. Barton was the chief designer and his ideas were bold. When I first saw his drawing, I was impressed with its originality. Gone were the medieval shields of Europe, instead there was a powerful eagle. In one talon, the eagle was clutching 13 arrows, representing the union of our 13 colonies. In the other, it held an olive branch, representing peace. Now, as I began to grow weary on this never-ended voyage, I found myself dreaming of that eagle and I uh, rediscover my strength. Perhaps soon I will find the land for which I have been searching for so long. Then may the eagle of my dreams take flight and guide me on my journey. The eagle of my dreams. Put that one higher. Dang it! Thank you. Uh, Lee Poe's journal. I would like to tell the story of how I came to be on this island. The very same island where my ancestor, Zhang Po, was stranded so many years ago. Um, probably this one. Uh, no. Go up there. I left Nanjing, China. I don't know how to pronounce Nanjing. On a ship in the spring of 1865. Oh. That's the Civil War year. In the spring of 1865. That's your parents now, Jing. Thank you. With dreams of incredible wealth working for the Transcontinental Railroad in the United States, after only a few weeks at sea, the ship foundered in the South Pacific. Carried by the currents, we were stranded on this island. When we built rafts and tried to leave this island, we found that we could not. The waves took the shape of monstrous hands and threw us back to shore. After these attempts to leave, we began to explore the island. We found not only other people of our race, Mongols and Chinese, but also Europeans. We quickly learned each other's languages, and now we work together with one purpose, to someday find a way to leave this island. Aww. Done. I'm done. I'm done. What do? Why, you did it. Okay. more stories can you help me put them in the right order oh my gosh do we have to do this like 12 times okay okay probably how do you want me to do this chat how do you want me to do this <laughs> What's fun for us? Cause I really like doing the doing the antebellum voice. But I'm terrified that I will come across a story that has not aged very well. And then I won't want to read it out loud. I don't know. I don't know what to do because we have to do this 12 times 12 times uh, okay no opinion kage work soon okay
Let's do this one and then we'll go back to the other game and maybe there's only the two games on this island. Who knows? Why does the island toy with us so? Must finally leave piece it somehow. So that it may let us leave. Too long have we been prisoners of this macabre island. When we were first shipwrecked, there was a sense of childish malevolence that came from the land itself. They would want to trap us here. Our first attempt at leaving met with little success, as the waves seemed to take the shape of monstrous hands and hurled us back to shore. After this first attempt, Mr. Ecurso disappeared suddenly from plain view near the strange mounds on the north shore. Did the island take him? Then last week, Mrs. Ecurso thought she heard a lost husband's anguished screams in the middle of a moonless night. Since then, others have begun to disappear. And now we all have dreams inhabited by their cries. We wonder who will fall, who will next fall prey to this island. Ah. In the end, that sounds like it. Set the end. Let me tell you how I arrived on this island. I remember it like it was yesterday. It was a season of winds, the moon of dragons, the moon of dragons, in the year 1407. We were on our ship, the Lotus Flower. It was one of over 150 vessels sent by Emperor Yongle in 1405 out of Nanjing, China. Our journey started well, but a few weeks into the journey, we were separated by a main fleet by a terrible storm. Our mast was seriously damaged and we lost our rudder. Fortunately, our captain, Yi Xuan, was a fearless and courageous man and quite brilliant. Even without our rudder, we knew he would lead us to safety. He kept our spirits high and as our ship floated in the currents for what seemed like months. When our water ran out, we thought we were doomed. In the end, we finally sighted this island. We used our last strength to row ourselves to shore. Yi Xuan praised us and all the ancestors for we were saved. Hmm. The story on the right makes sense, but the one on the left seems like it's still out of order. Why, you did it! Great. I was start with it. Oh, okay, thanks. Here are more stories. Can you help me put them in the right order? No, I want to leave. There you go. There he is. What do we do for you, sir? Oh. The island's got your friends. Take care, it don't take you as well. Okay. Let's do geography. Oh, good. That thief again. You're back, huh? You're back, there huh? Are plenty of cryptiles buried in here if you need them. Just use my maps. Okay. Remember, the red dot shows where we are, and the X marks where a cryptile is buried. Oh. You can do it. You must cross the Mississippi River two times. That's Mississippi River, by the way. You must go to Utah first. Let's go to Utah first. Don't cross Idaho. Wait, what? From here, go to Utah. And go to Ohio, and then Iowa. I'll get it, Santiago. That's like a threat. Don't cross Idaho. Joni, be careful. Don't, Don't cross worry. Idaho. I got it. Hey, you did it. It's hilarious how, uh... And here's a new one! How quickly one game always goes through, and how unbearably long the other game takes. You are here. Where is here? We're in Juno. <laughs> and we want to go to Fairbanks. Don't enter Canada. Don't enter Canada. Don't enter the Arctic or Bering Seas. Okay. Go to catch again. Go to Anchorage. <laughs> Go to Russia. I'll get it, Santiago. Go to Fairbanks. We turned hey, back Santiago. because the coast did not extend farther north. Here's a new one! 
Don't cross the Mississippi River. Just don't do it. We're starting there in Idaho. I said not to go to Idaho. <gasps> How do we not go to... Go to Texas? <laughs> that was a completely different map. Sure was. That was uh, Alaska. Go to Florida. Go to Mississippi. No, go to Tennessee. I'll get it, Santiago. It's stuck. Look out. That was a noise. Hey, you did it. Yeah. Yeah, that wasn't the con. And here's mm, a new one. Don't cross Canada or Illinois. Go to Kentucky. Go to. Oh. Go to Michigan. Go to Washington. <laughs> Joni, be careful. Don't worry, I, I got it. Why are we doing this? Whoa! I'm not allowed to go to Illinois. I'm not allowed to cross the border. Long story. Hey, you did it. <laughs> something, and something. A new one. Something, something, cake play. Don't enter Kentucky or South Dakota. You're here, go there. Kentucky. Go to Arkansas. Go to West Virginia. Nope. Go to Minnesota. I'll get it, Santiago. Falling deer, some ethanol <laughs> in the cornfield. <laughs> and a bachelor party gone wrong. Hey, Santiago, heads up. Hey. Thanks. How many do we have now? Five. We need 12 at least. Don't cross Georgia or Iowa. Oh. Go to New Mexico. Where's Iowa? Oh. Go to North Dakota. Go to Wisconsin. I'll get it, Santiago. New Mexico will go through Iowa? I don't think so. It's stuck. Look out. Oh wait. Who's <laughs> looking at it backwards? Hey, you did it. Halfway. You must visit two islands on your way to the Cryptile burial spot. You must travel to the islands in reverse alphabetical order. Oahu. Molokai. What island is this? Oh, Lanai. Kauai, Lanai. I'll get it, Santiago. Has to be the earliest, yes. Uh, I guess I didn't make these so easy, huh? Now be sure to take note of the warning at the. Sh sure. Thank you. I'll get it, Santiago. Okay, comes for L. Not in reverse. Joni, be careful. Don't worry, I, I got it. Hey, you did it. Which is worse. I got the crypt tile. We can move on. <laughs> we can move on. Don't cross the equator on your first move. You must cross the Atlantic Ocean on your first and second moves. I'll 
get it, Santiago. I think. All right. Hey, Santiago, heads up. There's just quotes here, and I think they could be better featured because they're interesting. Hey, you did it. But you can't even read them. Okay. You are here. We need to go. Oh, we don't know. The Crypt Isle is buried in the state bordered by Oregon and Wyoming. Don't cross the Mississippi River. Well, there's only one way to not cross the Mississippi River. Let's go to Florida. Don't cross Indiana, Illinois, or Colorado. That's a lot of the rules. <sighs> what? Don't cross Illinois? So don't go into Illinois? Go to Idaho. Oh. Arizona? Nope. Louisiana. I'll get it, Santiago. Nope. Shoot. Oh, that worked. Joni, be careful. Don't worry, I, I got it. I, I got it. Whoa. Okay. You must visit two cities on your way to the burial spot. You must travel to the cities in reverse alphabetical order. Anchorage last. Juno Fairbanks. I'll get it, Santiago. Look at this ridiculous route. Pew, pew, pew. Why would you do that? Hey, Santiago, heads up. Hey, hey you did it. Eleven. One more. Crypto is buried in the state bordered by Kentucky and Alabama. Uh oh. Oh, Tennessee. Don't cross the Mississippi River. Go to Texas. Go to Florida. Go to Tennessee. I'll get it, Santiago. Here's the last one for now. Hey, you did it. Wait. Do we need 12? A new one. Yeah, we need 12. Okay. Oh, that's too Remember, complicated. The red dot shows where we are. No, and thank the X you. Marks where a crypt. Bye. Still poking around looking for cryptiles, eh? Hurry up. This island's not content with taking me fellow townspeople, says I. No. Now it's taking me chickens, too. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, probably. All right. I'm going to speed <laughs> run through this one. I am back. Here the... Let's see how quickly I can do this. And if you're interested in these stories, you sound like a whimsical pirate, but also a Shakespearean whimsical pirate. Hmm. My story begins. That's the beginning of a story. Good. Uh, when we first arrived at the island, we were very busy, but our boredom ended when a ship with newcomers arrived. Oh. Oh. There we go. Um. 
We set out for Panama. Riches. Let's try that. Hmm. Nope. The story on the left makes sense. I actually have to read. The one on the right. My story begins when the, for the greater glory of His Royal Highness Charles V of Spain, of Spain, we set out from Panama in the late autumn of 1526. Great riches awaited those of us who joined him. Nope. At the end of our journey, we arrived in. Oh. Our party of 160 men was led by Captain Francisco Pizarro and his brother Hernando. Their goal was to lead us south into unknown territory. Um, as we headed south, our journey became dangerous. When several of our crew died from disease, the rest demanded that we return to north to Panama. Captain Pizarro grew angry at these demands and drew his sword. He slashed the line on the ground and dared anyone brave enough to continue to cross it. His brother Hernando was the first to cross the line. Then I stro too strode forward to join the captain. Only 11 more of our crew stepped over his side. Great witches, great witches, great riches awaited those of us who joined him. Why, you did. There we go. <laughs> Three, all right, nine more. Two. Great AZ witches. We begin this day, June 22nd, 1542. Thankful to be alive and hopeful that we reach our goal, the fountain of youth. As I sip my tea, I realize that exploring is not as romantic as I had hoped. My hopes are based on dreams, not reality. After we finish our tea, we'll begin our march inland once again. We march in the morning, later at dusk, because the air is a degree or two cooler. As a member of the Dawn Watch, I gaze upon the sun, turning this land into a miasma of heat, mud, and swamp in this place called... Florida. I hope it'll be a little cooler than today than yesterday. As I watch the cook boil water for our tea, I think of the boiling heat of a sun that burns our backs each day. I close today's entry thinking of our future. I pray that we reach the fountain soon, only then will this journey have been worth the struggle. As one of the crewmen... The Golden Hind when we set sail from England. No. Oh. Let's try that. Hmm. Nope. The story. I didn't even hear the clue. Hmm. The story on the right makes sense. Oh. But the one on. Are you sure? The left is wrong? How can you read this? Is it those two? He drinks his tea before the cook. Oh, good catch. Good catch. Why, you did it. That's tricky. Here are more stories. Can you help me put I totally thought the narrator was a was a woman for some reason. In that story. I pictured like an adventurous. I have to get ready to work. Okay. Thanks for hanging out. Hopefully we will succeed. And I can sleep as soon as we finish fifth grade. It was July 1864 as much as the drum beats of snares. Horses. Here she regarded this. T for T. may grant yourself a but um you may mm -hmm. there you go <laughs> have a good time at work
I really do need to go change. Oh, go, 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 go. Why you did it? Cool. Five. Ugh. Golden spike. Ah. What a time to be alive. There we go. Um, it's been a hard time on this island. I better start at the beginning. Uh-huh. Why you did it? Okay. Oof. Get lucky. Okay. Declaration of Independence. Okay. I have not yet begun to fight. Oh. Nice. This is what real life is like. You don't have time to read everything if you're like editing. Island watches. Oh. You go as fast as you can for content. What a tender illusion. Oh no. Oh, this is like poetry. This is like poetry. Still. Oh. I'll read that in a second. Let me tell you how the underhanded British could be. Oh. Oops. Ben Franklin. Hmm. The story on the right makes sense. Okay. But the one on the left seems like it's still out of order. <laughs> Let's read the poetry. Okay, kids. Looking at the story on the left, I can see that you've got the first and last parts correct. Okay, thanks. Can you arrange the middle and read the story again to see if it makes better sense? You don't make sense, lady. Thanks, goldfish. I sit and write today's entry under the canopy of a swaying palm tree. What a tender illusion. As the palm sways, I can't help but think it is observing me and reacting to my moods. It watches, perhaps through sensory organs in the plants, perhaps in ways I can't imagine. Somehow this island lives, it lives in a way we human inhabitants are not yet aware of, and it watches. If I could imagine how this place lives, it would be imaginings of a dream or a fairy tale gone awry. I do know this. As the dream continues, it is quickly becoming a nightmare. And still the island watches and waits. Hmm. No! Hmm. No! Are you kidding? It could be anything. As the palm sways, it's related to that. Reacting to my moods. And it watches. Why you did it? Okay, fine. Well, Journal, it's you and me again. I drifted around a bit after working on the transcontinental rail, but now I'm ready to settle down and work the land. Hmm. In 1862, while I was in the Union Army, Congress passed a bill called the Homestead Act. 
This is a pretty good deal, let me tell you. Mm, here's how homesteading works. Any citizen just plunks down on 160 acres of land. Then he or she has to stick around for five years. In five years, the land will be mine, free and clear. I can't wait. Finally, I'll have something to call my own. It's been 12 years since then, but there's still plenty of land to go, well, out west to go around. I'm going to get my own homestead, that's for sure. You can't get away with just fooling around in those five years, no sir. The law says you have to make improvements over that time. I plan to raise cattle. Okay, let's try that. I can't help but think as I watch the birds how this island has consumed our lives, our souls. Seabirds wheel and dart over the water and sand. How wonderful to be free, to fly, to soar. I begin my musings today about life on this island while sitting on a ledge overlooking the beach. This island has enslaved us, clipped our wings, so to speak. Perhaps it's a strange alien machine, a machine designed to study us, much like I have studied the wildlife here. What a bizarre experiment. It's as if we are subjects in a scientific experiment that has been forgotten. A test tube left to gather dust. Heck on seagulls. One bit your foot in Chicago. Now you hate them forever. Uh, benefit of the doubt. Did your foot look like pizza? Hmm. The story on the right makes sense. But the one on the left seems like it's still out of order. Looking Buddy. at the story on the left, I can see that you've got the first and last parts correct. Thanks. You did it. There. No, but I was mad. Cause it was under our table we were eating. Oh. Here are more stories. You weren't Can dropping you enough for it. Right oh. The boat. Um, few people remember they wearing sandals. <gasps> oh no! And they have little teeth, don't they? Few people remember Caesar Rodney, but I do. He was an important figure in our story of American freedom. Mr. Rodney rode to fame in 1776, July 2nd, 1776 to be exact, and what a day that was. On July 2nd, a vote was scheduled in Congress for the Declaration of Independence. All states but one had declared a yes vote. The vote needed to be unanimous from all the colonies. Mr. Rodney's Delaware was still undecided. He rode hard for 80 miles and arrived in time to cast his ballot. His vote, oh. However, he was 80 miles from Washington, where he needed to cast his vote. That vote would make the declaration unanimous. He rode hard for 80 miles and arrived in time to cast his ballot. He voted yes, and we are America. America. <sighs> this I Okay. Uh, I don't know about this story. I don't know about this one. You're envisioning this silly island as the Gettysburg Address and Emancipation Act. I don't know about this. Okay, that sounds like an ending. There we go. Only together. Hmm. <laughs> they both sound wrong. Hmm. The story on the left makes sense, but the one on the right seems like it's still out of order. Okay. Yeah. Why you did it? There we go. How many more of these? <gasps> Two more. In the journals. Have we done this one? No. Now I can save the tale, the tale of my true ancestry. Let me start at the beginning. Mm. 
I was working as a sailmaker in the Beijing in the shop when my great grandfather started when the Manchu came with their armies. The Ming rulers of China had grown weak, and so when the Manchu conquered the Ming in 1654, I was finally able to reveal my true heritage. When my father's father's father, Zhang Po, came to Man came from Manchuria to Beijing, he had to work hard to disguise his ancestry. <clears throat> We, the Po clan, not, come not from China, but from its northern neighbor, Manchuria. Oops. Okay, let's try that. I fly no more. <laughs> Today begins, as so many days in the past, with a meager meal of rice and stewed roots. I chew the food carefully and watch the birds soar into the clouds, dancing like angels in the sky. Once I too soared, flying beneath huge silken kites, made strong with bamboo struts. Alas, I can float amongst the birds no longer. I have grown old, and the island does not have silk or bamboo. Here on this island, food is not bountiful, and our lives are bound by the strictures of the environment. Instead of constructing kites, I help with plans. There are many different people who work together to attempt an escape. The story on the left makes sense, but the one on the right seems like it's still out of order. Looking at the story on the right, uh -huh. I can see that you've got the first and last parts correct. Thanks. Let's try that. Why, you did it! Great. One more! Mmm, Gettysburg address. Okay. I am pleased to say I saw Abraham Lincoln while he was president. I even had the opportunity to hear him speak. Here's what I remember. I was serving in the Union Army under General George Meade. We were going to face the Confederates in southern Pennsylvania. The Pennsylvania town was called Gettysburg. Well, it was a hot July and we get even warmer. We fought for three days beginning on that first July. Many thousands died that day. We won that battle, turned the tide. Mr. Lincoln spoke there a few months later. His speech came to be known. Yes, yes, yes. Henry Hudson. Sit down and let me tell you about a sailor from Holland I met on this island. He spent time with the late explorer Henry Hudson. Now, it seems Henry was quite a captain. But his London bosses ran out of funds to send him searching for a passage to Russia via the New World. So, the story goes, after the British let him go, Dutch East India Trading Company hired him in early 1609. So, off they go in late spring of 1609 with my buddy Wilhelm. Wilhelm Scream. It's part of Henny Hudson's crew on the Half Moon. When they reach New World, north of what is now New York, they end up giving the place Henry's name. That's right, Hudson Bay and the Hudson River were named after that Londoner. Ooh. Why, you did it. <gasps> yes. All right, folks, we're done. Look at that face. Look at that face. What are we going to learn today? Ooh, they're scaling. is within the face. The bones of those who have come before you now lie buried the bones? at the bottom of the sea. What arrogance makes you believe that your fate will be any different? Arrogance. We're not afraid to try. We're the clue finders. <laughs> and we're here to save our friends. Well... I'm not really <laughs> supposed to do this, huh? but it's been so long since the boys and I have had guests over. <laughs> All right. Oh. But before you proceed, the boys you must present a sack of silver cryptiles. Hey, Joni, do you have any silver cryptiles in your backpack? Yup, I do. 
Okay, now what do we do? You are now ready to begin. Go on. Take note of the eight slots in the wall below. Uh huh. Pretty nice, huh? <laughs> we had a whole decorating team in here. Each <laughs> must be filled using oh, a no. tile that Math. matches the number above it. Once all eight are filled, the first part of your task will be complete. But our crypt tiles only have these strange symbols. Oh no. How can we match them to the numbers? There's gonna be equations up here. Are great. Plus I read this language. Place any crypt tile into my mouth and I will translate it into your language. Oh now? Okay. Monch. I will now explain the labyrinth. The true heart I of the challenge. Don't remember labyrinth. After you translate all your cryptiles, you will still need to transform their numbers. To transform the number on a cryptile, use my brethren, the statues to my left and right. Each of my brothers I remember. will add a different amount to the number on a cryptile. Oh. According to the mathematical rule inscribed upon oh. his head. His head. To perform a transformation, place a cryptile into one of my brother's mouths. Yes. You may transform a cryptile up to four times before the cryptile disintegrates. I see. That's how you get there. Okay. Monch. <gasps> Hi, Shock. Thank you for the hydrate. How you doing, buddy? Thank you. Blah, 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 blah. Drink the waterfall. Hello. How you doing? Okay, that's both two. Okay. So what if... Mmm. Hoi, hoi. Hoi, hoi. Dang. That would be 30. Hmm. How many of these will work? 23 plus 20 is 43 plus 7. That'll work. 1. Monch. 23 is 30. 30 plus 20 is 50. Nice. Well I, done. Thank you. I hope I can get an answer out of one of these. Otherwise, it's going to be too much extra math we don't need to do. Hi, Vanette. Oh, hi. How are you? We were just learning some U.S. Um, geography, and I wished you were here. After four days of no net. Oh, no. Is that how your weekend went? Sorry, bud. Is it better now? Better now? One plus seven. Ooh. Eight. Oh, big brain time. We're trying. Big brain. 28 goes right there. Hold on. <gasps> Wait, 28 plus 7 is 35. Right? Yeah. Catch up with all gotchas. Oh, boy, yes. <laughs> you are wise. Thank you. Thank you. Can I do that again? Get some odd animated Atlantis vibes. Yep, yep. This game's been wild so far. Not bad. This is wild. Two. Okay, so here's what we're doing. We get some numbers down here. Yep, yep, the, those giant statues. But I don't remember the ones Goldfish was mentioning from Labyrinth. Plus 20. 22. 2 plus 20 is 22. Let's say it's 30. Shoot, that won't work. Uh, 22 plus 7 is 29. Nope. Also, math. Oh, yeah. We're doing math. I can only do these um, operations, and I can only do it to a single thing up to four times. 
So help me out, y'all. Please. Can I get to 13? No. I don't think there's a way to get to there. Can I get to 14? No. Can I get to 16? <gasps> I can get to 16. I could do 2 plus 7 is 9, and then plus 7 again. I can do that. 9. Nice. You may survive yet. Thank you. Alright. Can I get to 28? 2 plus 8 is 10. No. No. No, I can't. Can I get to 33? 2 plus 20. 22. No, 2 plus 7 is 9, 2 plus 7. Oh, 2 plus 7 is 16. 9 plus 16. 16 plus 7. 16 plus 7 is 23. Yeah, there we go. That's two operations. Three operations. Four operations. Now I can put it in. Yo. Yes. Yeah. Now we do it again. <sighs> Thank you. Forty. Oh. Well, that's a lot easier. How about 47? <laughs> nice. Let's put that right there. Okay. Oh, I can't get... Ooh, one. One plus seven is eight. No, I can't. can't get those. Can I get to 28? I can. Watch, watch me. 21 plus seven, 28. Yeah. Only two slots remain. Yeah, I can't get to those ones. Hey, it sounds like Cryptiles dropped into that hole are lost into the sea. What? That's the opposite of recycling. That's rude. That's so rude. They congratulate on this earlier, and then stopped. Five? Okay. Really? There's only going to be one? Ah, okay, okay. I'll do it. Thirteen. You are merely one step All right, chat. Unless you see a way success. to get to fourteen, I don't think it's possible. I don't think that's possible. Mm. No. Okay. Let's try again. Close. Translate. Seven. That'll do it. I'll take the seven. Yes. These crypt tiles seem really solid. Or what? Not. What? You have been fortunate so far. But your task is not yet complete. Look at the rule written on each of my brother's heads. <gasps> oh no. It tells you whether he will add or multiply. 
You need to figure out how much each brother adds. Oh no. How much he multiplies. You will now need gold cryptiles to proceed. That's tricky. But excuse me. Rude. Okay. I knew we couldn't get away from math. Ooh, the one's gonna help us figure out some stuff. Okay. Let's start over here. One times what? It's three. That's multiplied by three. Gotcha. Oh. I'll just take that. Right back in. <gasps> had to catch up with Genshin. Nice. No, I have not had time. I've been working four or five days straight, and I have one more. Well done. One more to go. Twelve times three is what? Two plus two plus thirty. Interesting. You update and finally reveal the Hydrocon? Ooh, I've not seen them yet. I just stepped foot in Fontaine for the first time. And I have not talked to Liney or whoever's at the bottom yet. But I have touched the statue. That's all I know so far. Don't at me. Fontaine is wonderful. Nice. I'm scared. Scared. I don't know, you might enjoy Fontaine. It's plus seven. Perfect. No, not perfect. Unperfect. Shoot. Dang it. Unperfect. Oh gosh. How much does that multiply by? You were skeptical? Hey, they proved you wrong? <gasps> nice. Nice, nice, nice. So what is 96? Surprisingly. Ooh. Is it 13? No. Oh no. Times 12 is the Oh no. Eight hours Fontaine just swimming. I haven't even gotten the water yet. Chat, can you help me? 12 times what is 96? Please. Please. That's a big number. Whose character be in the banners is Hydro Judge and Ice Cop. Ice Cop. Eight. Is it eight? Thank you, Audrey. Eight ten. Oh, I was like, I was stuck on three. Also, math. Yeah, Vanette. Literally, my whole month will be ruined if we can't finish this game, so we need to. Wait, no. Math hard. No, eight, eight makes sense. It's 12 times eight. Because it's two times eight is 16. Carry the one. One times eight is nine. Yes, it is eight. It's multiplied by eight. That's correct. Good job. That's useless to us now. You like get nine. Seven. Wait a second. Wait a second. That's not gonna help. Um. Nope, just eight. Yes. Again, math hard. Math is hard, especially when you've been working. Well, now we need to get creative. Now that we know everything up here. Math ruined you. 
but math and animation makes makes math plus picture makes animation is fun. Uh oh. Okay, 96 we can't do anything with, so let's get rid of it. <laughs> Hear the splash. Three times eight is 16. I don't think there's anything we can do with this either. So let's just keep trying. 53. That was Oops. Its limits of Oops. Transformation and has oh. disintegrated. I guess I can't do that. You failed seven times. Oh no. Sorry, bud. I almost tipped over my water. This is tricky. It was trigonometry. Oh no. Well, I, I definitely didn't do trig. I did um, stats. We got to choose between trigonometry and statistics. My brain hurts. Oh, I can do this. <gasps> no, I can't. No, I can't. Would you pull out the calculator? Yeah. Uh, this is hard. And I'm getting overheated because I'm getting stressed. Let's go. That adds by 30. That adds 7. Oh, 9 times 8. That'll do it. Watch. Watch. Watch this. Nine. Times eight. It's 72. Yay! Alright, we made the best of that. You are one. Okay, okay, okay. Next. That's the child's left over. Of my brother. Okay. Yes, sir. Seven times. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Oh. Watch this. Eight. 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 Thirty-eight. Cool. You okay. may survive yet. What's seven times three? Twenty-one. Yes. I'll take it. Clever indeed. Thank you. Um. Times eight is sixteen. Yeah, yeah. Watch this. Sixteen times three. Yay. Forty-eight. You are closer to your goal. Thank you. Okay, can I get this up to twenty? Eight. Oh, I can make it eight. Eight plus seven. Three times eight. No, times eight is twenty-four. Oh gosh. Eight. Eight times three. Twenty-four. 
24. Plus 30? No. Brain! Brain hurting! I think it'll work. Okay. Uh, mm. Okay. Watch this. Turn it into three plus eight plus eight. That'll work. No plus seven. Dang it. Do anything with this? You seven it? <gasps> no. Oh. Oh. Yes. Because it's seven, not eight. Thank you. That'll do it. <gasps> Thanks, Rin. We're all doing this together. I'm the class rep. I forgot. Only two slots remain. We're all doing this. <sighs> I'm not alone. Oh gosh. Real challenging though. That's rude. 20? Oh. That's not rude. I'll take that. Alright, how do we get to. Nearly one step away from success. How do we get to 19? Nineteen is twelve plus seven. That's not helpful. That's not helpful. The music isn't helping. Certainly not. It's like the music they play when you're supposed to be thinking of your answer on Deal or No Deal. It's not helpful. It's stressful. I don't think one can get us there. No, we can't. Eat. Each of the eight. Twelve. Yes. Thank you. Woo! Once Wesley, more. How much do you think these gold cryptiles are worth? Owen, where were you when I told you that the cryptiles were not made from any known element? Thank you. And certainly not from real gold. Uh, I must have been in that other dark, wet underground chamber. <laughs> you are close to completing your task, but your bones may yet end up at the bottom of the sea. Bottom of now the sea. Now you must take note. No longer are the rules inscribed upon my brother's Oh my heads. gosh. Now you must experiment with each of my brethren to discover his rule. <laughs> 600. Beware. You will need both gold and silver cryptiles to complete this final part of the challenge. Okay. Get to work, Santiago. Uh -huh. Hey, Joni, do you have any cryptiles in your backpack? Stop doing that. Okay. Thank you. Oh, shoot. Okay. Good luck. That's plus seven. <clears throat> okay.
That's plus 10. Okay. Thank you. Plus 8. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No, that's either plus... <gasps> this one is either times 6 or plus 10. Oh, that's tricky. Oh, no. Time six. It is time six. Oh, <gasps> but they have to be the right color. They have to be the right color. Oh no. Okay, okay, okay. <sighs> wait a second, wait a second. That might be plus 32. No, that might be plus 32. Watch, 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 watch. Plus 32, which means we can get this one. I hope. Yeah. Well done. Plus, plus eight. No, you're good, you're good. You're good, please. Time, thank you for helping. Time six. Plus 32. Okay. Um, wait, 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 wait. No, we can't get it. And. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Hey, Bonnet, want to use your calculator? Please. Times nine. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I have one right now. Oh, don't you have a phone? Times nine. <laughs> okay. Well, now we know. Plus 32 is not going to do it. Watching on the phone as I Genshin. Oh, nice, 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 nice. No worries. Okay. Can I get this to be anything? You got one? Go for it, please. I'm all ears. Nine into test nine into plus eight. Nine times nine is eighty one plus eight. Yes, okay, good, good. Now watch me mess it up. Very good. And there's eighty one. Okay, so now we know if there's a nine, a gold nine, we can put it there. Good job. Okay. Well done. Thank you. Okay. Nice. Nine times nine. Eighty one. survive yet is it time six two times nine is 18 
Two times six is no. Two times six is twelve. This is twelve. Twelve times nine. No, no. Wait, wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? Two. <gasps> Two plus eight is ten. Shoot. Shoot! What have I done? <laughs> ten times six is... Sixty? Where's your, where's your cheat sheet again? Plus eight times nine. Thank you, thank you. Plus eight times six. Can I get my phone? No, I'm just testing some stuff out. I'm just testing some stuff out. 600 divided by 18. Nope. That's not it. 600 divided by 42. Nope, that's not it. If we get a six, six times nine is 54. So that's what we'll be waiting for. If we get a five, so that's good. That seems to be the best way. I don't know how to make this 10 into a 600 though. Okay. I'm good. Yeah. You're right. Okay. Um, I know what to ha I know we can make it work if we get a one. Gross. Four divided by two. Twenty-seven. Nope. 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 Twenty-seven times six. Times six. Nope. Okay. We're close. Oh, that looks like a one. There we go. 100. <gasps> Yo. But ba bam. You are closer to your goal. Yay, hey, we got all the golds. Only two slots remain. Oh, okay. Good job, team. Yay! Okay. Six plus eight.
and then 50. You are merely one step away from success. 32. Is it 18? Yeah. Shoot. Yes. 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 <gasps> Wait, how'd you get there? Two plus eight. Ah, aha. You did a longer way. <laughs> this was, this was a really good brain teaser. That was fun. <laughs> Mathra? Is Mathra back? Oh. Where are we? Where are Joni and Santiago? I can't reach them on the radio. I hope they're okay. Ah! Wow. What is this place? It looks like we're in a big old specimen lab. Hurry! This way! <gasps> Ca Captain Clark? <gasps> Uh-oh. Are you dudes all right? Get us out of here! But we're trapped in one of those containers. Leslie, we found your grandpa. He's... A, a little tied up at the moment. You'd better get here fast. We're on our way. Oh, no. What was that? I don't know. But I think we're gonna find out. Leslie! I figured it out! I think we're on a spaceship! You think? Both of you, stop arguing. We have to get across there before those aliens, or whatever they are, catch up with us. These claptraps okay. Where are we? Hello? Countdown sequence initiated. T minus 16 quagnots. Who are you? Access to biosphere containment tank one is denied to initiate the bridge sequence spell words to create a safe path across Why not? Oh this thing you again that crazy language again Don't you have anything in English? I'm really good at English Pick up <laughs> tiles from the ground and place them in the empty spots on the bridge I will tell you each word you must spell to complete the bridge. This is just the same spell game. Spell this word, caught. Some islanders suspect that their missing friends were caught by the island's traps. Caught. All right, chat. First person to spell caught correctly gets to help me spell caught correctly. Go. No, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's That'll be the rules for this first round. Yeah, 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 yeah. Please. Spell it wrong. Well then fine, we'll do the other way. Okay. We'll do the same game we did before. Cod. Well you can see the spaces, but that <laughs> Don't listen to my captions. Here's what we'll do. I will spell the word how the game wants me to. Like that. Dragging it one by one. But you all need to type it in chat, but faster than I do. How do I get an advantage? I will skip through the hint. Because I am a smart boy. And I don't need the hint. So you get to hear it once. Sir, I'm playing Genshin. Yeah? Yeah? Now spell this word, throne. King George sat on his throne. I'm making money to, 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 to be able to play Genshin by streaming. I'm doing my work. Same here. Now spell this word. Revolution. Americans banded together. Got some artifacts. Today. Oh no, actually. <laughs> no, thank you. Revol. Okay, that's a lazy crossword. Look at that. They're just done. 
I'm just trying to make this interactive with y'all. I spelled it wrong. Don't tell anyone. Oh, you're on EU for the moment? It's Scrabble. Yeah. Trying to last a effort. <gasps> Access to the biosphere containment tank is granted. You mm. may cross. I won't even be able to play the Genshin until Wednesday. This is astounding. If then. There appear to be hundreds of different Earth species stored here. Whoa. Like specimens in a laboratory. It is a spaceship. They're frozen. Or like zombified. Oh, I wonder man. what the aliens want with Yeah, I can't do anything about it. Access to biospheric chamber will be denied for the duration of this experiment. Biospheric chamber status intact and full of earthling brains. Step forward and identify. I think it thinks we're aliens. Let's get some information. Uh, remind me again while we keep earthling brains aliens. in our biospheric chambers. Sustenance. Human brains are served in the finest restaurants. Please identify. Brains? They eat human brains? You'd better watch out, Leslie. They'll want your big brain for sure. Uh, <clears throat> we're just a couple of uh, specimen keepers, uh, specimen experts trying to release the uh, specimens. Specimens are released by indicating the correct predator prey simulation formula that will allow said species to flourish on our planet. Begin and identify. Is it a kid's game? The plot is wild. The last one, we became gods. This one, yeah. To release specimens, first run a simulation. Oh no. Select two birth species, a predator and a prey. If the simulation indicates that they can survive together for four Sorlax, approximately 200 Earth years, then all specimens in this chamber will be released. This is Spore! How are we going to know which species to select? Everything's written in Alien. Laptrap, interface with this computer. Okay. I'd love to, but uh, I'm having a bad show then. Oh my Lap gosh. Trap. All right, all right. Kids. Claptrap, do something, please. Whoa, yes. Thanks, Laptrap. <gasps> it looks like we need to select one predator from the list on the left <gasps> and one prey from the list on the right. Aww. How about sea otter and urchin? Because I've seen them. They grab... Snorlax. I seen the sea otters grab up and then bash them on a rock and they eat them. You can change the starting number for each species using the up and down arrows. This is advanced. Oh. Oh? Oh, look at the timing. Did I choose it perfectly first try? Survival. <gasps> I hear something. First try. Accept and get out of here. First try. First try. Oh man, why is the cool one already done? Dang it. I can't even congratulate myself. First try. Look how perfectly that is. That's... Dang! Why am I not a scientist? Why am I not a marine biologist? Look at that. I did a perfect... I did a perfect. Yeah. <gasps> Come on, let's get out of here. Or the silhouettes. <laughs> oh. Access to biosphere containment tank two is denied. Deja vu, dude. This place is just like the other one. 
To initiate the bridge sequence, spell words to create a safe path across. Use the letter tiles on the Where'd you see that? Fill in the empty spots on Who said the that? Spell the word I give you correctly to extend the bridge. Spell this word. Brought the captain bro brought. Where'd that one come from? <laughs> now spell this word. Horrible. The howling of the dogs created a horrible noise. Horrible. 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 Question. Chat, when you say when you say this word, do you pronounce it with an O like whole? Or with an A like har? How do you pronounce it? No. With an O? Ho ho ho. Now spell this word. Remain because traveling is much easier today. You spell it, or you you pronounce it with an O? Because when I listen to people from like Jersey, they say horror, horror, horrible. That's like the only region that I can think of that does it like that. Horror. Now spell this horrible. word. Scent. Most people find the scent of roses appealing. Scent. 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 Now spell this word. Scale. The scale of the planet. Scale. Access to the biosphere containment tank is granted. You may cross. This is hilariously just the same ending as the last game. Nearly. Ooh. There appear to be hundreds of other Earth species frozen here. <gasps> yeah, and if we don't unfreeze them, all right, soon, chat. There's gonna be a I'll let you. Brain I'll you. let you, you help me with this one. This machine looks just like the one in the last specimen storage area. Identify yourselves. Here we go again. Uh oh. Okay. Predator and prey. Predator and prey, and then we choose the numbers. <clears throat> Chat, what do you want to choose? Predators, we have anacondas, ocelots, frogs, bats, and pit vipers. And they all have a low birth rate. And on prey, we have fish, fly, moth, vole, and rat. Frog and moth, okay. Let's try that. Do you want to change the numbers at all? Moths have a high birth rate. Frogs have a low birth rate. Right now they're even. Fly works too. Uh, yeah. Want to keep it even? Or change the numbers? Do the science. If you want it like traditional frog knowledge, even? All right, let's try it. <gasps> Go. All specimens of the predator species have died out. Try changing the starting number for one of the species and try again. Okay. Two thirty. Oh, it's still more flies. Both species must survive for two hundred Earth years. More flies then. Simulation to be fifty flies. That's the flies are already winning out. The green icon is the frogs and the flies. But okay, we'll try it. Oh, did I misunderstand? Oh, I misunderstood. Oh, but Net has the knowledge. Yeah, I don't know what I was talking about. Yo. 
survival. Yo, good job. I hear something. We better hit accept and get out of here. Dang. I don't know anything. Good job. Good job. We did it. Cool. Fewer brains for the lunch <gasps> crowd. Need a lot of flies. That makes sense. I thought we needed more frogs because they died out. What's the word? Spell this word. Rhythm. The rhythm of... Rhythm. Now spell this word. Hazard. They reduced the... Shout out to Hazard. Where are... Mama? Where are you? Now spell this word. Adventure? Adventurous. <gasps> One of the most adventurous explorations of North America was the journey of Lewis and Clark. <laughs> Ad adventurous. Tonight we are victorious. Yesterday we were adventurous. Nice. Is this the one they're trapped in? Leslie, do you see what I see? These specimens appear to include humans. Do you think Grandpa is among them? Identify yourselves. Here we go again. Okay. Let's try again, chat. Your predators are wolf, owl, eagle, bear, fox, sea lion. And your prey are caribou, vole, mouse, shrew, salmon, and trout. What do you want to match up? My mind goes to bear and salmon, or bear and trout, but I want to hear what you get. Classic bear and salmon? Oh, okay. Um. How about a bunch of salmon? Let's do 50 salmon. And bear. 30 salmon? Look at all those little bears. Well, there's not a lot of bears. Not a lot of bears left. But hey, technically it worked. I hear something. We better hit accept and get out of here. Sorry, I overshot it. But hey, still good. Still good. Sorlax. Okay. <gasps> Is that it? Did we beat the game? Alright. Kids! Kids! That's terrifying. They're coming. Wow. Uh, hey, look at all these buttons. Don't touch them. We don't know what they'll do. <gasps> Dudes, what do we have to lose? Owen's right. Of course. Oh, sequence engaged. Of course, Joni would do it. Lorsnot, my torques and counting. Lorsnot, Bogart, Ty, Unk, Bogart, Ty, me. That would traumatize. Yeah, that's very scary. A uh, rainbow of the Civil War. Smash. What are you doing? Oh, the chickens. I think I pressed the tsunami button. Do we do it? Wow. Oh. Where did it go? 
That castaway reference. <laughs> He's a character we met earlier. left in Joni's backpack. Oops. I thought it was feeling kind of light. Oh, no. Wow. Where are they? Out there. Somewhere. And it was all a dream. It was all a dream. Why'd they save that fun science thing for the end, huh? Huh. Huh. I think we're all smarter than a collective fifth grader, y'all. We did it. We did it. This is a Titanic reference, right? Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> it was good timing because I need to fall asleep like right now. Yay! Okay. Wait. Oh, goodbye. <gasps> Adapt. Adapt. Oops. Adapt. Yay! Well, how'd, how'd y'all like fifth grade? Hmm? How'd that go for us? Last fit was cool. Yeah, you came in a good timing. That was pretty fun. It was a good time. Oh, thanks, everybody. It's not often that I ask a question and then, like, everybody, like, pops up and responds. That's nice. That was nice. No. Oh, that was good. That was a good one. Um, I'm immediately gonna uninstall it. That was fine. The plot was a little unbalanced, I'd say. Why did we always have to follow Joni and Santiago, you know? But, yeah. Very Dora experience these streams. Well, there's one more left. There's one more left. That will be on Wednesday. I should be able to. <laughs> should be able to beat it, but we couldn't get through the last sixth grade, so we'll try together. We all come back to class. It's a lot. <gasps> it's the last day of school. It's the last day of school after all, you know. Don't you know? So you better. Maybe we'll get a diploma. I don't know. We are double fifth grade, but not all sixth grade. Correct. Then it's October for you. <laughs> October is happening. Gonna do all the painting. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I just. I don't know what's going on for October yet, but we'll figure it out. That's a question for next week. That's a question for me to figure out. I think October 2nd will be our first October stream. And I'll figure something out before then. Oh. You know why? Because our affiliate, our, sorry. Who am I? Our Waffiliate anniversary is coming up. Early October. Our Waffilia anniversary is coming up, so I gotta plan something. Something. Hey yo, yeah, hey yo. I gotta sleep. Um, where should we go? Hmm. I'll make it spectacle. If you remember to be here, be bad. Hey, uh, 
Twitch wants me to like remind everybody about it, so it'll, it will be a thing that will probably be in your notifications that I'm not in charge of, but you'll find out. Don't worry. Uh, it's it's technically on the seventh, but it's not going to be on the seventh. It'll be some other day. I have the power to choose. Where should we go? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm watching one friend. I'm really feeling it. Let's see. Games Done Quick is playing nothing at the moment. They're playing nothing at the moment. But they will be playing Biker Mice from Mars, maybe. Unless that's over. It might be over. Yeah, it looks like they're over. Have we... Have we raided... I do love GDQ, yeah. Man. So there were some, um... There were some, um... MSF... Uh, volunteers hanging out outside work. I forget, I know, I know, but you got me on a tangent. You got me. There were some MSF uh, volunteers hanging out outside work. And I didn't get to talk to them. But if, if I did, all I would do is ask them, So, do you know Game Done Quick? Do you know it? Do you know it? They're not going to it's a it's an organization with so much more important things game so quick just decides to support msf but still if i see them again i'm gonna ask them um games done quick is offline never mind maybe tangent of course have we raided izashi black in a while I think we did. But she's playing Dead Space. She's playing Dead Space. And y'all like your spooky, spooky stuff. She's so scared playing Dead Space. Good. Good. Okay. Everybody, shh, 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 shh. Everybody be quiet. Everybody be very sneaky. Let's go do a sneaky raid. Okay. Here's that sneaky raid message. Quiet. Okay, can you can you all do something for me? Can you all do something for me? If you copy the raid message, I want you to go like this. I want you to like post it, and then right after, do all caps. Boo. Can you do that for me? It's a two-part message. It's raid and then boo. Done. Great. We'll do that. Yay! Okay. Okay. All right, y'all. We're gonna go raid over. Watch some Dead Space. But uh, I will see you all Wednesday for the final sixth grade. Everyone will finish up to education. Thanks so much. Thanks so much for the month. I was dreading. I'm still dreading tomorrow, but we got everything done we wanted to do, and I feel good. I'm going to go to sleep. Yay. Thanks. Thanks for making that happen. Thanks for the math help. I needed it. Yay. I'm going to get a midnight snack also. Okay, y'all. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good time. Have a good time over there. Don't let yourself get spooked. Be the spooky people. Bye. Have a good night. Bye.